What is up party people? My name is Daryl and today I'm going to be showing you all how to add a free live chatbot to your WordPress website. Now this is no ordinary chatbot. We're going to we're going to call this a virtual assistant because this can actually trigger certain messages based off what your visitors do. So let's say for example, your visitor goes to a pricing table, you can offer them a discount. If they go to your contact page, you can offer them something else or saying, hey, how can I help you, etc." Now this is exactly what your chatbot is going to look like. You can actually change the color. You can add an avatar of a really sexy girl and I know that sells all the time. People. People will click on it because there's a sexy girl, but this is exactly how the conversation was going. So I just put like, hey, uh, you know, are you watching me? And then I'm just like, hey, would you like a closer look at our offer? Yes, please. And now right here, you can see that we can actually start generating leads. So it's collecting emails and phone numbers while you're sleeping or while you're away from the website, which is really cool. So I highly recommend to get this and add it to your website. I've actually used this for a few years, but I actually had to take it off because I was just getting hundreds of messages from people and they just wanted help with their website for free. And I was like, guys, uh, I can't help you for free. You know, <laughs> sorry, I have to eat too. But there is a link below. It'll take you to the website called Tidio Chats. And Tidio Chat is actually probably the number one ranked live chat service out there because I've used quite a few. In fact, I was gonna use another plugin and there was a lot of problem with malware. Go figure, but there was a lot of issues and I'm just like, you know what, I'll stick to what I know best, Tito Chat, it's always been good. I've used it for, even when I logged into my old account, I saw messages from three years ago. It was pretty crazy, it's like, wow, they keep that information still, that's pretty wild. So I'm gonna go ahead and sign up for a brand new account. All right, I've actually used this quite a bit before, you guys can see before there's other, uh, you know, other logins, etc. So here I'm gonna go ahead and log in. I have agreed. You're gonna click on reading the terms and conditions. I'm sure everyone out there is gonna do that, but you know, I'm sure this company's based in the United States and everyone in the United States likes to sue each other. So that's that's kind of how, uh, that's the culture. Yeah, that, that's our culture right there. So right here, we're gonna go ahead and configure our live chat. So here I'm gonna go ahead and put um, uh, Paddywhack. Oh, cool. We're, we're already getting messages, all right. And then right here, you can go ahead and upload an avatar. So if you don't know, you know, if you don't want to post yourself because you're ugly, just go to unsplash.com, find a really good picture, and then there you go. Uh, here, you can go ahead and add in some colors right here. So I'm, what are you doing today? We'll do the, you know, I feel like blue is so, but you know, it's trusted. Blue means trust. So we're gonna go, we're gonna go with that one. Uh, right here, go ahead and put in your domain, your country, and your business. Here, I'll put in services. Now right here, they're trying to set, up, set us up with a first chatbot. Don't worry about this. Um, you can always go ahead and delete this. You can add more, you can add several, etc. So right here, I'll just click on continue and continue again. And right here it's saying, install the code on your websites. Don't worry guys, uh, this is really not scary. I know people panic when they see this. I'll show you how to do this step by step, every step of the way, so you don't panic. Here, I'll click on continue. And we're gonna go ahead and, wow, voila. So this is your dashboard right here. So right here you can see that uh, we have several steps to do. And over here are your options. So right here we have the home, we have the chatbot, we have the visitors, we have the widget we're gonna add, we have the channels where you can go ahead and decorate stuff, etc. So let's go to our dashboard right here. So the first thing we're gonna do right here is we're going to install this piece of JavaScript to our WordPress website. And they even show you how to do it step by step. You don't have to be a developer at all. So right here, I just clicked on WordPress WooCommerce. We're gonna go ahead and take this and we're going to copy this. Now we're gonna go to our website right here. And the reason why we're doing this is because when people visit our website, this code allows us to contact them based off of where they're at. So over here, I'm gonna to go to my appearance and we're gonna to go to our, um, our uh, Theme editor. Theme editor, <laughs> I know that sounds scary, don't worry. So over here, just go ahead and go to your footer PHP file. Everyone has one, everyone has a footer. And all you're gonna do is take that code and place it right before the body, okay? You have to have one there. So right here, I'll just go ahead and paste that. And that looks like it's working, right? Right there, Like it looked like that, there you go. There we go, yeah, so it looks just like that. And then here I'll click on update file, 
that was the correct one. Yeah, that is right. Now, also, if you don't want to do this, if you don't feel comfortable doing this, if you think that this might mess up your theme or mess up your other settings, you can always go ahead and go to plugins, go to add new. And there is a plugin that you can use to just, ins to just copy and paste that script instead of going to your theme editor. I'll go ahead and put it here. It's called header and footer. Header and footer. And this right here is the plugin that you'll need right here. So insert headers and footers. And once you do that, I believe, I have it on this website right here. It's under settings, insert headers and footers. And you can actually take that script and you can actually go ahead and put it, put it over here on your scripts and footer and just go ahead and paste it right there, et cetera. Just like that. Oh, my WordPress accounts thing was acting weird. But yeah, that's basically how you can do that. So I should I should deactivate that plugin, but, but yeah, so here we go. I've already added in, so I don't really need to mess with it anymore. So here I'll click on visit sites. All right. Now you can always test to see if this is working or not. In fact, they're actually gonna notify you um, if this was working on your website. So right now you can see that uh, it does recognize the script. So install Studio Chat widgets. It is already being installed and there you go. You know, right here, we already have the message uh, popping up on our website. So this is the first initial chatbot that we added when we first set this up. So let's go ahead and go through these settings. So right now your site's already connected. It's, it's already working. So over here, we have our conversation. Now, whenever someone messages you with something, I'll put like a yes, please. Whenever we talk about something right here, it'll actually show up and display on your um, on your messages over here, so you can see right here that the messages is actually um, you know popping up. You can see that we have the automated messages, the the representatives contacting this person, and they're having a conversation with each other, which is which is pretty cool. Now I think we have to actually uh, let me go ahead and go to my dashboard right here, and I think we need to install the plugin, or is it already installed? So over here under plugins, installed plugins. And I think we need to go ahead and install the Tidio Chat plugin. Yeah, so over here under Add New, we can go ahead and install the Tidio Chat plugin. Now, personally, I don't know if you need the Tidio Chat plugin after you enter that piece of code, but right now I'm just going to go ahead and just install it anyways because um, for those of you who don't want to use the script or anything else, I'm just going to show you there's a plugin for it as well. So here I went, uh, went ahead and activated the plugin. Go to Tidio Chat and just click on Tidio Chat and it's going to ask you for your login credentials. So over here, same thing. You just go ahead and log in with your credentials and then the, the, you'll be brought to your dashboard. So if you don't want to mess with the scripts and you don't want to do all that stuff, you can just go ahead and install the plugin and then from there, log in. But you still will need the script if you want the chat bots to contact people while they're on your website. So I'm gonna go over here and go ahead and click on login. That's just an alternative for you if you don't want to use a script. I know people out there are kind of like, eh, et cetera. So let's go ahead and keep going through this. So right now uh, we have people uh, on our websites and they're talking, so that's pretty cool. Over here we have chatbots. So right here we have the visit site on the very first time. Now right here, if I click on add a chatbot, we have additional commands. So right here we can do order a phone call. We can do a visitor leaves a page, a, a visitor leaves form, uh, operator doesn't respond during the conversation. Visitor returns. Ooh, that's a good one right there. So right here you can see that Tidio has already created automated messages for people who visit our site and then leave and come back. So right here, I'll click on save this chatbot. Right now it's saving our chatbot. And this is the flow of everything. Now this is a very small flow. Here I'll click on save, and then save and activate on your website. But I'm gonna to go to another one and I'm gonna show you the flow of everything and how it works and how the chatbot will basically communicate with people, etc. So right here, let's go ahead and add another chatbot. Now, what else do you want on your website? Now you can kind of look at this and kind of say, okay, cool, you know, we can go ahead and, and boost sales online. We can um, you know, auto reply, welcome new visitors, uh, leave, a visitor uh, leaves the form. Uh, right here, abandoned carts. Here we go ahead and put in uh, this information right here. Here's a discount code, etc. Now, of course, if you're using WooCommerce, you probably already know how to create coupon codes. So right here, click on OK. And now this is the flow right here. So before, we have the abandoned cart. We have a delay. And then right here, 
you can see how it says, we've noticed that you abandoned your card. Could you tell us why? And based off what they say right here, it's going to basically redirect them to a, a certain uh, response, I guess you can say. So right here, you can see that, um, uh, sure, we understand. We'll try to work on that right now, blah, blah, blah. And then from here, they're going to say, well, the shipping time sucked. So over here, we can go ahead and see how it's how it's how it's basically communicating with everyone. So you can see the flow of everything. I just deleted that. So I should probably I'm going to redo that. There we go. So right here, you can put no need. Thanks. And then, you know, you can basically see how the, how it's responding. So if they say no, thank you, it'll take them to this one right here, which says, all right, well, in that case, let us know if there's anything you need, et cetera. So that's basically how you can add this on your on your site. Pretty cool, pretty easy. Now let's go back over here to our uh, options right here. So right here we have no visitors. Now you will need the pro version actually to see if there's visitors on your websites. So again, that's another reason why I'd recommend the pro version. The pricing is actually really, really cheap and I'll go over that in just a bit. Over here we have our contacts. Uh, over here we have our appearance. So you can see here we can kind of decorate everything else. Um, you can actually integrate your Facebook account with this as well. Uh, your emails, your chat page, etc. cetera. Uh, live chats, again, you can go, go ahead and mess around with all these settings. Uh, your analytics, this is where all your analytics will come out right here. Now in the settings tab right here, we have a lot of options. Now I'm not gonna go through every single option here because at this point, it's pretty self-explanatory and there's a lot of features that they offer like integrations and I'm not gonna go through every integration here because that's just gonna take a lot of time. A lot of people don't need that. But let's just go ahead and talk about the upgrade and we'll talk about the pricing, etc. So right here you have one communicator and then you also have um, 100 chatbots. So number of users reached. So what this means is basically saying how many people can contact you before you have to upgrade to their pro version. And right here, I mean, guys, it's very, very cheap. I mean, 5,000 people uh, for 15 bucks a month is pretty, pretty generous on their ends. And you can also do per year and you can get two months for free. So I would just, I would probably stick with this pun right here. I mean, five, uh, 5,000 users is a lot of people. So I don't know how much traffic you're generating, but um, that is basically one of the better pricing models. You can also go with communicator as well. So these are for operators. And again, this is um, this is the uh, same thing. So the price for three operators is always around $15 a month, but you can always get more as well. And then again, your price goes up as well. So it depends on your site. It depends on the traffic you're getting, et cetera. So um, I highly recommend it. Uh, Tidio Chat is basically one of the best free, it is the best free, um, uh, it is the best free live chat plugin out there. They have chat bots, they have auto commands, they have uh, everything that you pretty much need. So make sure to check out Tidio Chats. Also, if you have any questions about Tidio Chats, let me know in the description of this video and make sure to like this video and I will see you guys all in the next video.